Hi everyone! This video will be about life energy. And in the next 10 minutes I'll show you how you can increase your energy levels so you would feel much better than you do now and become proactive in your life. Being energetic and proactive is very important. If you are full of energy, you create your own reality the way you want it to be. But if you are low on energy, well, the reality creates you unhappy, depressed and poor you. If you are low on energy, you cannot control your life. You have wishes and desires, of course, but you have no power to take the steps in order to make your dreams come true. If you have plenty of life energy, you are full of curiosity and you have a strong desire to learn and do new things. You readily live unsuccessful past, well, in the past, and start your life over with a great joy and you never look back because you are confident and you know that your life is your life, where you are the boss. Life energy is free. It's everywhere and you can take as much of it as you need. Getting energy is relatively easy, but keeping it is hard due to a high level of stress and addictions in our society. Stress, addictions, hard thinking and agitated mind drain your life energy very fast, while good rest and a calm, peaceful lifestyle replenishes it. When you think about rest, you probably imagine yourself lying on a couch, watching TV or reading the news with a glass of brandy and a cigar till midnight. But is it a real rest? Nope. After thinking all day long, your mind keeps thinking but now about all the bad stuff which is happening in the world. And after injecting caffeine into your body during the day, you are now injecting different poisons into your body, such as alcohol and nicotine during the night. You go to bed agitated. Your mind is racing. You cannot fall asleep and when you do, your alarm wakes you up in a few hours. You are exhausted and tired all the time and you need tons of coffee during the day so you wouldn't just fall asleep in your cubicle or behind the wheel. It's a different story when you rest well every night. You come back from work and you go to a park for a long relaxing walk. You listen to the birds, you listen to your body and feel the peace that surrounds you. You stop thinking and just observe the world outside and inside you the way it is. You return home and go to bed early, relaxed, with no thoughts in your head. You sleep well through the night and wake up totally refreshed before your alarm goes off. You feel the power and you are ready to face a new day with joy and curiosity. In this state you feel your body so well what it needs and what it doesn't that you can easily quit smoking, stop drinking alcohol and stop doing other stupid thing, things that you have been doing for years. Learning how to rest well is not the only thing you must consider. You must also give up all addictions, all the useless things that you do in your life regularly and have no mental power to stop. It's not only about drugs such as nicotine, caffeine, alcohol and ecstasy. It's also about behavioral addictions such as shopping, watching TV, reading the news, surfing the web without a purpose, and repeat hard thinking. Your head, when it talks to itself, drains your life energy very quickly, and this is the reason why you want to use the thought process only when it is really necessary. You should keep yourself thoughtless and just silently observe the world around you 
all the time you are not solving a task. This way your subconsciousness will get unleashed and will start to generate solutions to your problems without involving hard repeat thinking. The thinker will kick in only when necessary to tailor the solutions that come from your subconsciousness. Based on my experience, it's not that easy to keep body and mind in this balanced state all the time, especially at the beginning. But with time, it becomes easier and easier. It's okay to fall down from time to time and return to the bad habits to later realize that they are bad. If you have ever experienced a higher state of being and then fall down to a lower state, you will want to return back, because there is no way back once you get it. Now I want to summarize what I've just said. Remember, you must learn how to rest well. You must learn how to calm your mind and relax your body. Only if you feel refreshed and full of energy, you have the power to change things in your life. Get rid of all addictions. Start doing it only after you master the art of resting and start feeling yourself good and, ener and energetic. Addictions rely on lower energy levels. If you are full of energy, addictions simply cannot survive. And this is it. Thank you for listening.